Welcome one and all to Disfigure. My name is Deep Space Matt, and today my battle to survive the endless nightmares of the dark just got a new weapon. With the saw launcher, I'll be guiding my spinning projectiles to create a whirlwind of destruction around me. And with the new charged rounds, I can deal crazy amounts of damage. Will it be enough? Let's find out in Disfigure. All right, here we go with some more Disfigure. This is the free roguelike that just keeps on giving. There has been an update that has added a brand new weapon as well as a new upgrade tree, and that's what we're going to be checking out today. Now, if you want to take a look at the full patch notes or the game itself, which if you are interested, you might as well because currently it's free, but the developer has stated that might not always be the case. I will have links in the description down below, but for now, let's get right into it. Here we are, the Saw Launcher. Fires piercing projectiles that follow your crosshair and despawn after two seconds. Ooh, that's very unique. And the stats here, bullet damage seems a bit low. It is. I mean, the minigun is lower but has a high fire rate. This one does not have that quite high of a fire rate. Pretty low fire rate. Bullet size and then bullet speed also fairly low. But I guess we kind of want the bullet speed low so we can control it better. Let's take a look at the perks here. Frost saws hit three distinct enemies with a single saw to freeze them for a second. That probably is pretty good, especially later in the level when there's tons of enemies about. Bullet damage. Fire rate. Saws take a second longer to despawn. I like that. Damaging an enemy with a saw increases its damage by 20% up to 100. Alright, so we can't kill it once. Uh, we can just do more damage. Damaging an enemy with a saw temporarily increases fire rate by 10% for 2 seconds. That could go crazy. Up to 60%. 5% chance to fire charged rounds, which deal 6 times damage. So charged rounds, that is the new upgrade tree. Hit 4 distinct enemies with a single saw to damage them all by 300% bullet damage. I like that. And fire saws in 2 directions toward your left and right, but saws despawn a second quicker. We get less damage and less fire rate, but double the saws. All right, let's unlock this and head in. We're going to go, uh, you know what, let's go map one here. And we're ro rocking hard, which hopefully is not a mistake. But we should be okay. All right, so. Oh, yes. So let me put on. Okay, we're looking good. Where's our enemies? Okay, there we go. Okay, fire rate. Not too bad, actually. It feels okay. Of course, there's not a lot of enemies on screen, so maybe I don't like that later. It's the damage. I need more damage. What do we got here? Chance to bleed. Here's the charged rounds. 25% chance for every shot to deal double damage, but we lose on our fire rate. Clone sentry. Every 8 seconds, spawn a sentry, which aims and shoots at whatever you're aiming. Circle vision. Oh, I like, I love the upgrade on the circle vision. Because we definitely want that. On death, enemies explode into two smaller projectiles of whatever killed them. Uh, interesting. So, does it, it creates more saws. And do I control those saws? I, oh man, I want to test out the new, definitely the new upgrade tree here. We're 100% going to get that, but I want to see if I, I want to see if this works. Grab this. Oh, it does. We control the little saws as well. Oh, it's amazing. Okay, this, this is good. This is fun. I like this weapon. All right, what do we got here? Shrapnel projectiles deal 50% damage. We got flashbangs. Every five shots, we get a flashbang. More bullet damage. I like that. There's the bleed. And the shield barrier really helps. I do like the shield barrier. Effectively giving us uh, one more heart that regens. But I think I want to get my damage up. Where does this tree go? We get more damage, size, speed. Man, lots of hits to our fire rate on that tree, but down here, more piercing. We really don't need the pierce because we pierce already. 
but going up this top tree might be worth it just for the extra damage. We're going to grab this. Because things are getting a bit heavy now. <clears throat> Electricity inflicting shock. After killing an enemy, your next shot will deal 50% more damage. I kind of like that. There's the circle vision, the flashbangs again. Uh, back to our damage increase. Right now, it just depends on if I want my circle vision up or some doom rounds. Man, I do like doom rounds. If doom rounds kills an enemy, fire rate is temporarily doubled. Oh yeah, we definitely want to go down here. We need that extra, extra fire rate and we can increase damage and bullet size of the doom rounds. We're grabbing this. Oh man, it's just a, <laughs> a circular saws of death running around. It looks great. Uh, piercing rounds. Yeah, we, we're not worried about that. We do get bullet size and bullet speed. Bullet speed is probably good because they only last for a few seconds and we can hit more. There's the circle vision and we projectiles move slower. Or we get a singularity every 12 seconds. No, let's get, let's get our circle vision. Start working on this. Yes, all enemies just, just clump up. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Char oh, here's the charged rounds. I think we might grab that unless we... Oh, man. Well, we already have the Doom rounds, so I'm not worried about this. It's going to show up again. I'm more worried about the new upgrades, which... Let's try charged rounds. 25% chance for every shot to deal double damage. What's the rest of this tree here? Every time a bullet damage is an enemy, it has a chance to become a charged round. Ooh, more bullet damage. Killing enemies with a charged round creates an explosion. 10% chance to fire a shot that does triple damage. Damaging enemies with charged rounds will spawn a temporary vision circle. Killing an enemy with a charged round increases fire rate. Oh, this is great. This is great for us. Every time you shoot, fire an extra bullet that has a 100% chance to be a charged round. And we lose fire rate. That doesn't matter. Doom rounds are going to double our fire rate anyway. We're grabbing this. Oh, we are just we're just running through this so fast. Okay, movement speed. Where does this go? Bullet damage increase to movement speed, not moving, pickup range. That I do like swiftness. I do like radiation. Although every sixth shot, we have low fire rate. It might not be as good with us. For enemy projectiles, fire guided missiles every three seconds. And or the emissive rounds. This is on our charged, our charged rounds tree. Extra chance. What's what's the base chance? 25, so you get 35%. Yeah, let's do this one. And it'll it'll let us know how often we are getting charged rounds as well, because we'll get that vision circle. Oh, which is right there. So we're getting the charged rounds quite a bit. 35% is nice. Okay, we've run out of... Where's all the... Okay, there you are. Like, where'd all the enemies go? I want your experience. Electricity, guided missile, plasma charge. Every five kills, fire plasma charge. Might be okay. Ricochet rounds. Um, bullets have a 50% chance to ricochet towards a nearby enemy. That's probably good. I was about to say we have piercing. We don't need ricochet. But it's going to add automatically target an enemy. Or extra fire rate. Hold on. Fire rate goes to more bullet speed, more fire rate. Yeah, we have a bunch of stuff that reduces our fire rate. Oh, and shooting extra projectiles. Every third shot, shoot a spiral of nine smaller projectiles. This is going to go crazy. We got to go. We got to go quick draw. Oh, I guess the, are the charged rounds the yellow ones? Okay, so we know when we get charged rounds anyways. Hey, get out of here, Roach. None of yous. Oh, yeah. Uh, bullet speed, more fire rate. Every time a bullet char damages an enemy, it has a chance to become a charged round. It doesn't say what the chance is, though. We do extra bullet damage. Uh, man, do I grab the shield right now? 
just to be safe. Let's grab the shield right now. It's still early. We should be able to get it up okay. Just in case we run into trouble later on. Or I, you know, I do something stupid, which is definitely possible. So we have the freezing. Hit three distinct enemies. I don't know. I mean, I feel like if we just get our damage up and our fire rate up enough that freezing them, we're just going to be killing them immediately. So the question is, do I want damage rate or fire rate? Not damage rate, <laughs> bullet damage. Uh, oh, I don't know. I like both of these. We have a lot of perks that increase our damage and a lot that decrease fire rate. I'm going to grab fire rate right now. Man, the levels come in super fast. Projectiles will pierce. We get size damage. There's the ricochet. Shield boost. Increase to weapon stats. I like that. Okay, here we go. Shoot an extra projectile. We got to take it. We got to take it. We got to go crazy on this. Less damage. Oh, maybe I should have taken that damage now that I think about it. I was too busy focusing on the fire rate. Okay, well, no, we're doing extra projectiles. We won't be doing a lot of damage. Oh, no, none of you. <laughs> but now we got double projectiles. Uh, and a triple shot. Uh, circle vision slow down, slows down enemies. Outside of vision moves slower. Okay, I want to get a triple shot, but I want to get my damage back up. So we went down, what do we go down? Went down 30% and now we're going to go, where'd it go? Here we go. We're going to go back up 30% with the hollow point. Oh, I almost ran into that, that millipede there. Charged trigger, killing an enemy with a charged round will increase fire rate. I like that. Shrapnels deal 50% more damage. Damaging enemy inflicts fire. Circle vision size plus fire rate. Oh, I love all of these. I love all of these. Let's continue with what we got, though. Let's go. Let's keep going down this trigger tree the charged uh charged rounds tree oh yeah look at all of you there oh the extra the extra little circle visions are very nice very nice shield boost there's the piercing more size more speed Damage, but less fire rate. I don't mind that. Up in damage. Minus 5% fire rate. That's super negligible. Now we can like shoot way out there too. I feel like this is going to be pretty good against bosses as well. Bleed, wildfire, every fifth enemy killed by a bullet will explode into wildfire, damaging any nearby enemies. Bullet cyclone, fire a cyclone, or when it gets activated. Spotlight, let's uh, increase our circle, our, no, that's cone vision, what am I doing? We don't want that, I thought that was the circle one. We could re-roll this, or I could take bleed. Where does bleed lead? More damage. Removes their health. It doesn't apply to bosses. When outflow is inflicted on an enemy, they are damaged again by the combined damage of the three bullets that triggered outflow. Wait, what is outflow? Shooting an enemy three times inflicts outflow. Interesting. Um, that probably works with us. We have all our different saws engaging. But honestly, honestly, it doesn't it doesn't excite me. Bleed does not excite me. We're gonna re-roll this. 
Stopping power excites me a bit more. 60% <laughs> damage. Bullet size up. That looks great. Circle vision size. Yes, we're going to grab stopping power. Larger saws. Oh, it looks great. Man, being able to like sweep around. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, we could totally. Is this a sitting still? Is this? I mean, it's not quite AFK because you really can't AFK with these little, these little green guys floating around. But you can definitely just sweep the screen. And this is with the base two seconds. We added. We can add an extra second. There's the bleed. Shrapnels deal more damage is nice. I might want movement speed plus the pickup range. Because we're going to get faster enemies. And the sweeping works now, but it might not work later. I also kind of feel if I if I do this, I might get too locked in. Oh, like see that roach over there to doing a continuous movement and an enemy is going to sneak in while I'm sweeping on the opposite side of the screen. There's the triple shot. We've been increasing our bullet damage. I think I do triple shot. Every time you shoot, fire an extra bullet. Oh no, this one. I mean, we get an extra bullet, but it's going to be a charged round. Which is going to deal double damage. Yes, go with that. <laughs> uh, this weapon is so fun. It's, just, it's like having an army of bullets. Kind of, it's like I'm having, I have like a, a Pikmin saw army. If Doom rounds kill an enemy, fire rate is doubled. That's what exactly what we're looking for. That's exactly what we're looking for. Yes. I feel like I'm gonna get my get lost of where my character is. Like if I go here, like sure, my character is ooh there somewhere. See, I almost I was paying too much attention to how the saws uh, obscured me since they're going crazy. Move slower is not bad. Bullet speed and fire rate. We'll go with that. And you know what? Maybe we get something. We gotta get something. Maybe a little flashy here. Like the burn. Or the shock. Or the wildfire. Because now that we have all these. Essentially. Ooh, careful. Bullets here. I need my circle size larger. I'm gonna get caught from behind by something moving fast. Oh, we get a weapon perk. So we can go back here, get the damage. I think we're okay, though. Have the saws last a second longer. I don't think we care at this point. We're making so many extra saws. I don't think it matters. Damage an enemy with a saw increases its damage by 20%. That's nice. Damaging an enemy with a saw increases fire rate by 10% for two seconds. Up to 60. I mean, we're grabbing this. I don't know how it stacks. If we, if we hit this... And we get that double on the doom round. Probably this first. But let's go this. Oh, this is wild. <laughs> this is wild. But yeah, there's just so much movement on the screen right now. I gotta really focus on my character to make sure I'm moving in the right direction. More movement speed while not shooting. No, we're constantly shooting. More pickup range. I'm not excited about any of these. We're gonna reroll. Sprint, bullet cyclone, plasma charge. There's a burn. Let's just grab the burn. I mean, I think we're killing things super fast, but hopefully it helps later on. 
Well, no, actually, never mind. I guess we're not. We're getting a bunch of burn here. We got uh, every time bullet damage, we get a charged round, we get a sentry, singularity, fatigue, enemy projectiles are slower. Where does this lead to? Shoot an enemy projectile to deflect it. Deflected projectiles spawn other deflected projectiles. Moving slower, killing an enemy that instantly will instantly destroy all projectiles they fired. Split into two player projectiles that go in random directions. I mean, that's not bad. We get over there. I don't know if I want to commit all the way down here just to get to this, though. Uh, maybe let's just continue with... I want to get this charged round tree all the way up. Ooh, watch out. Okay. Oh, there's there's the boss. There's the boss. Get you. Get your arms down. Just oh my gosh, we got you. Oh, that was crazy. Get an extra heart. Okay. Oh, that was good. Just I that's what I figured. I figured it would be great against bosses. Because we can just our bullets don't just do a single damage to it. They're just swirling around it constantly. Circle vision size. I think I want to head that. Even though triple shot sounds exciting. I I want some, some clarity as to what's going on around me. That's good too. No, we're going to grab glow. Who's, who's shooting those things? Get out of here. Oh, we got these little these little crawlers. I don't like them. I do think the developer has stated that at some point there'll be like a bestiary or an encyclopedia. So we know the names of all these things. I just kind of make it up as I go along. And maybe, I don't know, maybe some <laughs> a little bit of lore of what we're doing here. Are we like on an alien planet? Marooned in the darkness? Or have we been shrunk by some kind of crazy experiment? More damage for shrapnel projectiles. Uh, circle vision slows down enemies. Maybe I do that. I mean, we did increase movement speed and we're now we're going down 10%. But then we lead, we get extra speed after this. And circle light will freeze enemies every three seconds. Oh yeah, come on, let's go. All right, I feel like, I mean, this gun goes to like zero to a hundred in no time flat. Alright, what do we got? More shrapnel, shield boost. Uh, here's the radiation. I don't know how fast we don't I, you know what I would love actually to add to this would be a stat screen so I know exactly what my fire rate currently is. Every fifth shot shoot a flame. <laughs> uh shoot a flame. Ooh, we got a lot of bullet damage too. Let's add let's add radiation to this. I do like the radiation tree. I've used it a lot. It's very nice. It does kill things super fast. And our doom rounds will double our fire rate every so often. Oh, we got the little little triangle guys coming out now. That
All right, just, just move in a direction. Pick up all of these. And then, like, back up this way, because I'm sure they've accumulated. All right, what do we got? Bullet Cyclone. Guided Missile. Oh, yeah, here we go. Charge around, create an explosion. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, look at them. It's wonderful. Oh, man, I am definitely going to, like, run into something, though. That's how I'm going to take hits. But at least, I mean, I got my shield. I got my shield going. Okay, don't know about the radiation pick. I don't think we really needed it. I think maybe something better, like applying shock, would have been better. Not that I had that choice at the time. 10% chance to fire a shot that does triple damage. Bullet size, bullet speed. I mean, these are, they're nice, but we're going to reroll. I want something even nicer. Radiation damage increased by 10% for each enemy revealed in vision. Movement speed up. Shield boost. Spotlight, no. Uh, we're going to grab, I mean, this is a great... Like I said, I don't know if I want to go down this uh, radiation tree now that I've grabbed it. Let's just grab some extra movement speed. It will allow us to pick up experience faster. Oh, I almost... Oh, did I get hit? I think I got hit by that. Because I don't have my shield anymore. I didn't even notice. But we should be able to kill enough things to get the shield back up in no time. Alright, what do we got? Pickup range, I like. More damage. Killing 50, every 50 enemies while shield bear is active increases weapon stats. That is, that is a really good, this is a really good one. We're grabbing this. Of course, I need my shield activated. Which hopefully uh, should be soon. If I remember, it's every 200 enemies. There it is. So now every 50 enemies, we'll just increase all our weapon stats. Ooh, watch out, watch out. We're almost at 12 minutes here. I don't know when the next boss comes. I don't know if there's a, a boss at 15 or if it's just at 20. Ricochet rounds. That was one that we passed on. Uh, wildfire is nice too. Let's grab Ricochet. I, I was going to say, let's grab the ricochet and see how that works. I don't think we're going to be able to see what exactly is going on. I presume they're ricocheting towards a nearby enemy. All I know is that they're killing everything. That's all I know. And there's just, there's just so many. Oh, jeez. Okay, I lost sight of my character there for a second.
Man, I wonder how long you could last with this. Because when you when you defeat the final boss, you can end the run. Or you can just go sort of into endless mode and see how long uh, you can last. Okay, here goes the last perk. 5% chance to fire charged rounds, which deals so charged rounds. So does this change my current charged rounds to do 6 times damage? Hit 4 distinct enemies with a single saw to damage them all by... I don't think that's that's not going to... That's not going to happen. And we get less damage, less fire rate, but we get we get an extra saw. I think we're, we're having so many extra shots. I don't think we need this. And I don't think we need this either. And in fact, I don't know. I'm fine with how we're doing right now. Uh, well, I mean, we'll grab this. Six times damage. Charged around chance is 100%. Interesting. So is all my... All my saws are charged? I mean, it can't be all my saw, saws are charged. Because it's giving a 5% chance. Oh, never mind. I got it. All my saws are charged. And my charged rounds have a 5% chance to be a 6 times damage saw. We're going to grab that. I... Oh my gosh. Oh, this was this was great. It's beautiful. So the pink ones, I'm sure, are the six damage ones. At least that's how I'm reading it. Okay, what was that noise? Is that a boss? Oh, jeez. It is. Yeah. Oh, it's something big. I don't think that's a boss. I think that's just a... Uh, a new, uh, the new enemy that comes out here. It's been a while since I played level one hard. I've been playing more of level two. But we took care of it. Oh no, it was a boss. There's a heart hand here. Oh jeez. Do we just kill a boss and not even see it? <laughs> Do we just kill a boss like, I guess not technically off screen, but out of vision? Maybe. Oh gosh. Did I get hit? I didn't get hit. Okay. Still got my shield. Oh, I don't like these little br these branch walkers. Don't like them at all. I mean, I thought the crawlers were bad, but I definitely don't like the branch walkers. Okay, kind of sweep around. Let's move in a direction, maybe. Okay, a damage and bullet size of Doom Rounds are doubled. Yes. Yes, we got Calamity Rounds now. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, this is this is actually this is actually bad. This is bad. I can't see my character. I think we can affect the opacity in the settings, but I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. I made my bed. I'm sleeping it. Man, I wonder if I can just, just head straight. Just head straight. And does this get everything in front of me? It does. I feel like I'm not getting enough experience, though. Everybody's just clumping up behind me. If I kind of do this and come back this way. This weapon is super fun. This whole game is super fun, you know what I mean? Oh gosh. Got you. Okay, almost another level up. Oh, what is that? What is that? What was that thing? I don't honestly I don't I don't remember ever encountering whatever that was before. Damage for the ricochets. Flashbangs, piercing. We don't need piercing. That would just give us bullet size and bullet speed. However, where does it lead to? More damage on our piercing. Infinite times. No, we're good. We're good. We don't need to go that way. Let's grab this wildfire. Every fifth enemy killed by a bullet 
just because I want more, I want more fireworks on the screen. Let's add uh, a little bit of more, a little bit more color into this monochrome world. Oop. Oh, what is that? A giant bouncing ball. Did that hit me? It didn't hit me. Okay. It was very close, though. Oh, no. I think I got hit. I think I got hit. I did. I got hit. I lost my shield. That's okay. That's why we have it. I feel like the shield barrier is an upgrade. I'm going to just grab every single run. And at least at its base as well as... Oh gosh. It's getting a bit hard to see and avoid carefully. Uh, the base... Grab the base of the shield barrier as well as that uh, extra percent of chance of in increasing... Or every 50 enemies you increase your your stats of your weapon... Every fifth shot, shoot a flame that deals 20 damage and inflicts fire. Uh, do I love any of these? I mean, I, Blaze sounds fine. Let's reroll. Killing Spree. Killing enemies temporarily increases fire rate by 5% up to 50. Resets after 3 seconds without killing. Uh, we do get less damage, though. 25% to instantly inflict damage, setting enemies on fire. We're going to go... I got, yeah, let's go fire cooldown minus 30%. More damage on the fire, but less cooldown. Uh, we get less damage here. We're gonna go, we're gonna go scorch. Oh yeah, get those get those big guys down. Okay, shield is back online. Excellent. Oh yeah, I don't know. Oh, those those double cloud car guys. But at least they give a bunch of experience. Oh! <laughs> Man, I'm surprised I did not get hit at all during that small little sequence. Watch out for you. Okay, yeah, the double guys aren't so bad. They just look big. It's the branch walkers I do not like. Maybe if I, I might, I would say it might be better for me to cl be closer to my character to kind of protect, but I, then I just can't see myself. Cone vision, we're not worried about. Extra damage on the shrapnel. Fire missiles every three seconds. I mean, just, just fire missiles, I suppose. <laughs> just because it's, it's an upgrade I don't get that often. Because I'd rather... Uh, focus on my main weapon but sure we have guided saws and now we have guided missiles and it, it all just goes crazy okay coming up on 20 minutes here should have another boss that maybe we get a chance to see.
Oh, there it is. Oh, gosh. Move, move, move. Move, move, move. Yeah, we're definitely seeing this one. Take you out. Take you out. Don't die to everything else. I'm just going to move in a circle kind of around it. Because I don't want you to face me. I don't know what you do when you're facing me. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. We, we've taken too much damage. I got to focus on everything around me. Okay. Don't care about you facing me now. I just care about surviving. Let's move around the other side. Oh, my gosh. This is not good. This is not good. We're going to die. Every five seconds, I mean, a thin wave of life that re light that reveals everything for an instant. Killing 100 enemies while shield bear is active. I mean, we don't have it active right now. We're going to reroll this. Shoot a flame. Any upgrades that increase bullet damage also apply to missile damage. That's pretty good. Dam damage in inflicts shock. That's the kind of thing I was looking for, too. Their next damage will be taken by 20%. Uh, we're going to grab that. Should help with the boss. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I got to sweep around me and hit the boss a bunch. Sweep around me, hit the boss a bunch. Oh, man, it sounds awful. I think we're getting the boss down. We got a bunch of his, uh, oh, uh, tentacles, feelers. We got you. Oh, we got you. <laughs> All right. We did it. That was great. Uh, oh, wait, what do I do here? Oh, there, click. Uh, you survived. I did. All three bosses. Uh, that was crazy. We're just going to continue here uh, just for a little bit. But uh, this build, this gun is very nice. I love, I like the charged rounds. Uh, grab this heart back up. The charged rounds probably should do good with the minigun, I would presume, as well. I don't know how well the rockets are helping me, because they don't seem to be they don't seem to be hitting anything, right? Our saws are doing everything. I wonder, I mean, it'd be nice if at this point, after you kill all the bosses, that maybe we'd be getting a little more experience, just to level up a little bit faster. I don't even know, now that I think about it, are there any, are there any upgrades that increase our experience rate? I don't recall. I wouldn't also mind a... An upgrade tree that increases the number of enemies on screen. I mean, that would work. That would increase you instead of doing a an upgrade tree. Oop. That just gives you a flat, you know, you gain 10% more experience. Have one that, you know, increases the amount of enemies on screen, which would effectively do the same thing. And possibly balance it out by making it harder. I think even... Even with how well a lot of these weapons work there's our shield with playing on hard mode which pretty much i only play on hard mode now uh and even harder mode there's got to be like a nightmare mode because we really just lay waste to everything all right i don't know how long <laughs> i don't know how long this is going to be. So I'm going to call the video here. Uh, but once again, this has been Disfigure. This game is super fun. It's got a lot of content in it. They're adding more content all the time. Oh, geez. And it is 100% free. You can download and play this right now for yourself. I will have links in the description down below. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. And if you made it this far, thanks for watching.